Hey guys, my name is Rybro, and now I tricked ya, I'm down here. Um, okay, so welcome back to Sort the Court. I make an episode of it, and then like, like, three months later, I post the next one. I don't know why I did that. It's, I, I really do like the game, but we need to proceed, we need to make progress. I don't think there's any boobs in this game. Um, <laughs> I really enjoy this, personally, because I'm the one that makes the decisions, and I'm the one that makes the community, so I, it's really, like, transparent, like, my decisions, like, it, you just have to look outside to see what I'm doing. My words go through people's ears, and, and then it goes through a window, and then it it shows what okay I'm gonna continue <laughs> yeah okay okay <laughs> hello friend can't you gaze into oh I love doing the voices too okay uh, what it it's circle I didn't know there were circles do I have a mouse I have a mouse now I think what I'll do is I'll play like five hours of this game <laughs> and then uh, and then just and then just smush it just squish it into like a fi a 20 minute video or something like that. I would do the, like, the uncut thing that everyone seems to do. Uh, like, Markiplier is really good at that. I can't, I can't do that. <laughs> Citizens say a monkey has been running around flinging stuff at them. Should we put a, out a bounty on it? Um, sure. Like, he could, he could throw as much stuff as I want. I would want to have the right to throw stuff. Well, maybe not at people, but, like, just throw stuff at the... I, I throw a lot of stuff. <laughs> uh, sure, just to, just to make sure we're safe. We'll have that monkey captured in no time. Oh, I don't want it captured. I want to see the talent of this monkey, how it flings stuff. It's just staring at me. Does it want something? No, it doesn't want something. No, I'm crazy. What just happened? I feel sad. <laughs> Well, the pupil gets bigger if it's if it's in love, or if it's entertained. So I, I, nothing happens. So <laughs> I'm sorry. Name's Mulder. If you want to know the truth about everything, you're gonna want to hire me. Yeah. Okay. You you can go next to uh, the puddles outside. Uh, I don't. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go investigate something. <laughs> yeah. I screwed everything up. See the town? I, I don't know what that bridge is for. <laughs> My lord, I wish to embark on such a treacherous quest. Okay. Mm -hmm. For the kingdom, I shall return to you, lord. <laughs> okay. I'm back! And, and missing my upper body. I found these tiny yellow stones. Pretty cool, right? They are pretty cool. Could you show them to me? Oh, yay! Ooh, I wish to put on a show. May I have funds to do so? Yes. Mm -hmm. If I can't entertain, you you should be able to. Very good. Mew. That's certainly a magical cat from before. Does this mean we're friends now? Yeah. Mm -hmm. We can be friends. Well, I guess we are. Can I hold you? The gesture show was loved by the court, but everybody put and put everybody into a happy mood. Okay. I thought it said but everybody. I was like, oh no. They got the monkey and they to get throw tomatoes at him. <laughs> Can I trouble you for a sandwich? Surely the cost of wooden sandwich is nothing to a great king like you. Okay, mm -hmm. sure. Fantastic. I'm excited to eat this. <laughs> but don't just get ham and cheese. That's boring. Get chicken bacon on a flat bread with lettuce and honey. <laughs> I used to go to a Subway and th that's what I would get. I would get a, a, like a six inch Italian uh, ham and cheese, and my friend Jay, he, like, once he knew about that, the second he knew about it, he was like, no, and then he suggested what he gets at Subway, which is what I just told you. I, uh, oh, wait, no! <gasps> that was his, his special thing! Why did I just go off on a, on a rant of what he gets? Ah, uh, everyone's gonna know. Unless editing! Sir, the so <laughs> Now I can't hear. Some of them fell in my ear. Sir, the city's population is growing steadily. Our records of citizenship indicate that 250 people now call the city home. That's more subscribers than I have. Good job! <laughs> Yay, I'm happy. <laughs> I'm happy they haven't complained that each individual house looks exactly the same. <laughs> Yay. With a bigger city, we'll need to maintain even higher happiness in order to keep people satisfied. Okay. 
Make sure you pay attention to the citizens and their issues to raise our happiness. Yay. Anyways, we still have lots of work to do. Let's make this city even bigger. Yay! I love I love development. When game makers they, they make their first like version of the game and then they move on and then they you see the changes and like what they liked and what the people who played the game liked. This, this is version 2.2, I think it was on the when I when I started doing it in the intro. Did you notice that? <laughs> By the way, remember earlier when I mentioned the Council of Crowns? Yes. I've heard a rumor that one of their members has just been searching the land for a new ruler to join them. Perhaps they are aware of our progress. Uh, they're gonna copy us. They're gonna go somewhere else. You ready for the truth? Aliens have already landed, and they're in our city. You think we're safe? How do you know aliens are- Oh, okay, because you can only look up, okay? <laughs> so, so you can only tell me news, like, about the clouds. That one looks like a lion! That one looks like a cease and desist! I think we're safe. We have pretty good people that mm -hmm. will defend us. And bridge. <laughs> I think so too. Why would they want to harm us? I, I don't know. Has, has someone already harmed you? He was like a jello human and then someone just squished him. And he's, be like, uh, he's been like that forever. Seems happy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why, did you meet another eye? Now you're gonna go off and find a corpse to, to uh, lay on. In the, in the eye sockets. Because when you're dead, I think like your eye sockets shrivel up or something like that. I don't know. Some refugees have arrived in town. Should we welcome them? Yes. Welcome. But but don't show them me first because the they might not like my voice or anything like that. I'd like to build a new granary. This could help us expand our population, but it'll cost a bit. Is that is that also underground? What's a granary? Where all the 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 grand parents meet? I don't know. A storehouse for threshed grain. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Weirdo. You got it. This will help our city grow. Yay. The Guild of Pineapple Traders offers a gift, sire. Will you accept it? Is it a pineapple? I knew liking pineapples would be a good idea or would lead me in a good direction. <laughs> oh, what is this strange place I found myself in? Albert, do you know where we are? Oh, wait, no, that's an owl. I'm sorry. My, oh, my. Hello, you kin kingly person there. I do believe I am a bit lost. Might I stay in this town for a while? Yes. We accept people and owls. Mm-hmm. How nice. Albert and I shall find an inn to stay at. <laughs> I'm sure you. I will see you again. Albert seems to like you. But the owls are attracted to me. A friend from witch school wanted to thank you for your help, so we got some magical cookies. Okay. <laughs> Cookies! <laughs> My sister made cookies last night and I can't stop eating them. I, I have a cookie problem. But it's okay, I stand all day and record stuff. Hey, oh, uh, it's Slime Day. Got a present for me? Oh, you, you got a present for me? It's, it's <laughs> Winston. <laughs> yes, Winston, I have a present for you. It's on uh, that hill by the church. Some villagers are threatening to leave unless we pay them a sum of gold. Should we listen to their demands? Um, no. That's like saying, like, play a game or I'll unsubscribe. It's like, well, that's not really, you're not really inspiring me to play that. I, I won't be in the good mood when I go to record it. Like, you could just suggest it, because, like, I don't, I don't want those kinds of uh, people on the channel. I want people that are, like, understand why I upload stuff. Um... I can understand if people leave if I say, oh, too much, but uh, anything else than that, then, uh, yeah. Some nasty bugs have made a home out of our garden. Can we have some gold to hire an exterminator? Yes, and we need the deep pelter turbo. <laughs> uh, no, that's for animals and bears and other people. <laughs> uh, sure, yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you, sire. Our plants are safe. There's a party I'd like to go to this evening, my liege. Might I have the rest of the day off? Sure. Mm -hmm. Thank you. We will toast to your honor. Aw, I like toast. <laughs> Just holding pieces of toast up in the air. Too vibro. <laughs> We're pals, right? Think you could find a home for my friend? He's between places right now, you could say. Okay. Wait, between places? There's here and nowhere else. <laughs> Just grassy fields. Uh, but okay. Mm -hmm. Thanks, I knew I could count on you. Albert asked me to come here and tell you a story. Uh, tell a story with you. <gasps> Hi, Albert. 
Tell us, tell me a story. A yellow bird meets a green bird in the sky. Does the yellow bird soar higher than the green? <laughs> if I say yes, you'll be offended because you're wearing green. So the bird, no. Mm -mm. Oh no, the yellow makes the way for the green, who pumps his wings and climbs ever higher. Okay, I guess there's no wrong answer. Gliding on a gentle breeze, the green bird soon meets a blue bird. Does it make uh, does it make time to stop and sing? Yes. Everyone mm -hmm. stops and sings when they meet someone. <laughs> oh, the sweet musical notes of the two n n new friends fill the air. I will have to come visit you again sometime, kingly person. It's fun to tell stories with you. It's fun to listen to your stories. Oh, <gasps> they're working. I've got good news. I've got news for you, sir. The city's population has reached 500. The townspeople are celebrating. There's going to be a huge festival in the swear. Uh, festival in the swear. Festival in the square. <laughs> <laughs> a growing population will demand even more happiness now. Be sure to keep all approval high. What is that you have in your hand? Is that a trophy? Anyway, just wanted to give my congratulations. Let's keep working hard, okay? Okay. It's fun. <gasps> my sword! Wait, I said it right this time. Damn it! My sword! <laughs> Crafting the dragon blade. All we need now is somebody to wield it. I'll be the wielder. <laughs> I'll leave it here with you and spread the word to our heroes. If they wish to take up the blade, I'll send them here to you. Yay! I got my sword! <laughs> Oh, it's gonna disappear now, isn't it? The festival of the then town square celebrating 500 citizens is going strong, bringing happiness to all those who attend. I got my sword! It's just stuck in the coins. I knew I'd get it sometime! Yay! <laughs> my brooms are worn out, and it's my birthday. Think you could buy me a new broom for a present? Sure would be nice of you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Happy birthday. I got my sword! My lord, I have returned. I am ashamed to inform you that I return with nothing. Shall I show myself to the dungeons? No. Mm -mm. You forgive me? Oh, kind and gracious lord. Bless you. Yes, we need you at the 500th anniversary. Feeling spooky today? Not really. Mm -mm. Good things are happening. Not even a tiny spook. Little baby bat. <laughs> Did you just call me a bat? Festival in town square is winding down and people are getting back to their normal lives. Ew. The plant people citizens have taken root and grown into a lovely field of flowers. Can you hear them rejoicing? What does rejoice sound like? Hey. Yep, I hear it. <laughs> How long did that sword take? Well, there's been like multiple updates and stuff, but it took me over a year. <laughs> Great, I'll have a shipment of swords sent to your barracks. There's a bunch of goblins in the lower quarter. I'll slay if I feel all kinds if you want. No, remember, weird people are our friends. Fine, let's your people get bullied by goblin thing. <laughs> the workers we captured and recruited have sped up our building processes, resulting in more tax income. Ooh, tax income. Something I'm not interested in. <laughs> but, but, what a... Yarno! He's made a yarn! Where's your, where's your buddy from Unravel, Yarny? Hello, hello, I am Yarno of the Comfy Kingdom. You may not believe this, but I am the royal assistant of King Pin himself. <laughs> King Pin. Pin. Cause he's a. <laughs> Cause he's yarn. Indeed, the very same. I've been noodling around. No, you've been string around this kingdom of yours, and I. Oh wait, what's that over there? Wait, you can walk around, and you don't lose any of yourself. Oh, Yarny, Yarny does. What? What is that? <laughs> button boy. Yeah, he, he's a button, but he has a, a another button over his mouth. Good sir. Do you happen to see a blue fellow come through here just now? Strange noodly limbs made of yarn. Yes. Are you two friends? Mm -hmm. Buttons and s buttons and yarn. <gasps> T-shirt. <laughs> Or sweater. <laughs> I knew he was around here somewhere. I'm going to find that darned Yarno. <laughs> yeah, I believe you. He's been running around claiming to be Kingpin's royal assistant, which of course he is not. In fact, I, Button Boy, who represents the Comfy Kingdom in the esteemed Council of Crowns, 
Have you heard of the Council of Crowns, good sir? No, I haven't. <laughs> but I think you're gonna explain it to me anyway. Really? The Council of Crowns is a group where the world's top kings and queens gather. They discuss matters of diplomacy, trade, warfare, and all matter of important subjects. Important? Surely as a king yourself, you'd be interested in joining this council. I've had an idea. Perhaps you'd be interested in this. I never thought I'd be inspired by a button. <laughs> That Yarner has been giving me nothing but trouble. If you could somehow put a stop to its shenanigans, I might be able to get you a meeting with Pia, the advisor of the Celestial Kingdom. If anyone would be able to induct your kingdom into the council, it'd be her. What do you say? Will you help me catch that darned yarn? Yeah, okay. <laughs> Very good. I'll leave the details up to your discretion. Once Yarno is out of the way, I'll set up a meeting with Pia. Thank you for your assistance in this matter, good sir. I'm sure we will meet again soon. I hope so too. He just rolls, rolls out. Ah. Oh. Ooh, might I borrow some gold for new juggling balls? Okay. Mm. Enjoy your balls. You haven't been talking to Skelly, have you? Yes. Mm -hmm. What's wrong with Skelly? Here, take this. I was never here again. Oh. <laughs> what? <gasps> Hi. Oh, good day, kingly person, a friend of mine. Uh, it's pronounced right, bro. You don't have to say that sentence every time. Albert wishes me to stop by and say hello. So, hello. <laughs> Thank you for letting us to stay in your wonderful city. Ah, meet new people. More new relationships. All that. Well, actually, in the game, I'm just a king and I just nod. But, like, the person actually playing the game is, gets relationships and stuff. My button. Uh, the button is my favorite character right now. Because <laughs> the button gave me that amazing speech. Inspiring button. Hello, good sir. I have returned. Will you give me some money this time? <laughs> Okay, I have, I have 700, sure. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm feeling generous this morning. Thank you for the money, good sir. This is good money. He's made a wool, right? So I could say he stole my money. And then and then I could get that grandma to sew him up. And with the button and with the yarn, we could actually make a sweater. I noticed you speaking with that wizard again. Is he bothering you? I can have him banished from the city if you don't wish to be pestered with his magic offerings. I can get rid of him? Oh, well, sometimes he's nice. No, I don't want to banish him. Oh my god. I didn't I didn't know I'd have to be this responsible. <laughs> okay, it, uh, just just to move things along. Mm -hmm. Very well, I'm informing the guards not to let him back into this. Oh. I feel sad now. A wave of dark magical energy passed through the city during the night, causing spooky nightmares. No! <laughs> Oh, we almost made it. I'm her right now. Dark energy? No! Positivity beats dark energy. Causing spooky nightmares for many citizens. Oh! Wait, wait, was that in the nightmares? Because that's kind of scary. Just like a bag with feet. Okay, I think I'm going to end it here. And I like see seeing things change and like the, the village is, well, if, if this would move and it doesn't. We actually have like a lot of people. We have 760 people and I really love recording these episodes. They're so fun to do. So th I hope you enjoyed. I, I, I will try and post these episodes more, more frequently and uh, I think it's just because they're longer episodes and I don't like want to spam like half an hour episodes because you you guys won't want to watch all of them so i hope you enjoyed the highlight was uh, the the button giving the the speech I, I i don't even know what to do with that information now uh but i'll figure it out so thank you all so much for watching i love you all and i hope to see you in the next one so bye for now Rob, roll out <laughs>